KC24 is your local election headquarters. California's primary election is eight months away, and voters will notice some changes when they head to the polls. Today, Fresno County Clerk and Registrar of Voters Brandy Orth held a public meeting to discuss this new election plan. Our Pedro Quintana was there and has more on what voters should expect at the ballot box. Pedro. Well, Alex, on the Fresno County Board of Supervisors directed the Elections Office to implement the Voters' Choice Act that was signed by former Governor Jerry Brown in 2016. Now, this would allow an expansion to early voting and upgrade the county's election system. The Fresno County Elections Office is getting ready to roll out a new way for voters to cast their ballots in the March 2020 California primary. We're making it extremely easy for everyone. Changes that make it easier, like adding 33 ballot drop off boxes, getting rid of precincts, and replacing them with 50 voting centers countywide. Right now, in the polling place model, a voter has one specific day to vote at one specific location for a total of 13 hours. In the voters' choice model, we'll have 50 vote centers across the county. Uh, voters will have up to 11 days to vote. The voting centers would be open on weekends and holidays. Voters who forgot their paper ballots will also be allowed to get one at the voting centers. The idea is that now you can go to any vote center on any of those days and cast your ballot. And we will have the technology to provide you your specific ballot at that vote center. The three million dollar upgrade will bring in new voting equipment that adds an extra layer of protection against voter fraud. Orth says one thing that won't change is how voters fill out the ballot. Basically, for the voter, the experience isn't going to change. We have a paper ballot, you color in the bubble, and you make your choices. And so that is going to still be the same. And if you weren't able to attend this public meeting, there are a few more meetings planned around the county. I'll post that information to our website, yourcentralvalley.com. In the studio, Pedro Quintana, KC24, local news that matters. Pedro, thank you. The Costco at